Yahoo Sports. For the first time in the Skip Holtz era, this is the first time they have started conference play at home. That first conference game was against FIU, and the Bulldogs came out with a 43-31 win. Now they go on the road to Rice, who are winless so far in the 2019-2020 season. The Bulldogs look to continue their good start as conference play heats up this week in Texas. We made the huge emphasis this week about two things. We talked about getting into conference play, and we talked about playing at home and kind of getting back to having that home field advantage where we, we had a three-year period there two years ago where we were 14-2 and two at home, and here in the last two years we've been 6-6. Six and six. Project Fobbs does not want his team to feel bad for themselves at all. They're off to a slow 0-3 start, but this time they just want to play football, especially with the big matchup that they'll be facing at the Cotton Ball Stadium, Prairie View View and 8. A&M in the 96th Annual State Fair Classic. This is the 42nd meeting between these two schools. I mean, it's football, you know. Um, you know, I mean, that's just part of the game, you know. Uh, uh, you know, when you look at it, you know, uh, we just, we just got to play better, you know. Uh, it's really not about, you know, how that feels. It's just about, you know, us looking at ourselves on film and getting things corrected so that we can play better, you know, this particular week. The Saints gave up over 400 plus yards in the air last game against Russell Wilson and the Seattle Seahawks. Luckily, they still came out with the win. But you can't give America's team, the Dallas Cowboys, over 400 plus yards and think you're going to come out with the win, especially this year. Because they're off to a hot 3 0 start, and Dak and Zeke are hitting on all cylinders. That big play, that explosive, explosive plays, we're rather than let them dig and duck. We'll corral to that instead of giving up 20. 15 plus yards catches and stuff like chunks. Uh, this team can be really, really good, and we've got to focus on that and how, how do we get there. Uh, and it's about taking that next step. It's about focusing on the things that we can control.